Captain. Thank you and hello and hello again and welcome to the Living Strong uh, uh, Television Network broadcast. Uh, well, I'm your host, A. Prophet Johnson. Uh, Y'all know what to do. Uh, call that friend, that neighbor. Let them know. Say, hey, guys. Look, uh, living strong is on. We're in that fastest 30 minutes. And it starts right now uh, with a bump around in profit. Well, profit, why are you bumping around again? Well. Uh, I guess because there's well, not too much to do, I reckon. Not too much to do at all. So, hello and welcome again to uh, Living Strong. Uh, let's get started on something here. I'm, I'm just flipping through the Bible because I'm really wasting my time is what I'm doing. And if y'all don't mind... Would y'all please uh, not bore me with, with rushing me to get started on something that people don't pay no attention to? And that's all there is to it. You know, we're getting close to Christmas time. Yep, we're getting close to Christmas. And it's really boring around here. Well, have a habit of the whole. It bit it. Well, Prophet Johnson, no, 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 there's nothing to do, y'all. There's just nothing to do. There's just nothing to do. Uh, nothing at all. Mm -hmm. Well, Prophet Johnson, I'm tired of Rudolph. Well, I, I'm not. I love the fella. Uh, Captain, I'm going to find the scripture. Now, enough of that. I still don't have no scripture. don't need one, Really? That's why I'm still going to flip through the Bible just like I've been doing. Captain, why don't we give them some of that radio message a little bit again? Don't you think that'll be good for them? I think so. Why don't we give them a little bit of that radio broadcast? And uh, I, I think that'll be good for, for us to give them a little bit of that. And we'll go on with the same, same little old message. Oh, hello and welcome to the... Uh, did I say that already? Now... If I finally gotten your attention, I hope so. I've got a question. Is Jesus king or is it COVID-19? Many are going to say, Lord, Lord, didn't I? No, 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 we don't. No, we can't. No, we won't. Six feet, we got to stand from each other. And six is the number of man. And God is saying, why six feet? Why on the sixth day did I create man? Why not eight feet? Why not 12 feet? Why not three feet? Why do it have to be six or seven? Because God standed in the middle. And the Lord is trying to get the whole world to do one simple thing. Turn to God. But we want, we'll, we'll turn, to, I don't have time. See, that's where my blood come in at. I get Rudolph back. Now, we don't have time for that. We only want COVID-19 out of the way so we can get a release, a rescue, a relief, a little bit of our anguishness out and go back to doing the same old stuff that we've been doing. Well, I got news for you. It's amazing, Captain. Hallelujah, Captain. I feel the blessing of the Lord. And the Lord is saying, double for your trouble. He said, my ways are not your ways and my thoughts are not your thoughts. For many have taken me for granted, saith the Lord. But I say unto you that the time of the end doth draweth nigh. Behold, I stand at the door and knock it. And if any man will open up, I will come in and sup with him 
and he with me. The father said that y'all want relief, but you don't want transition. Hallelujah. You're tired of the antagonizing forces, but you don't want to turn to God. So therefore, my Lord, my God, am I going to... Therefore, y'all are not paying no attention. They talk about the peak and flatlining in the curve. The Lord is saying, ha, 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 ho, 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 he, he, he. Here we go again. No, folks. Everything is rising. The deaf angel is climbing Mount Everest. He's steady rising. Y'all can't see this? This is not just a natural battle. This is a spiritual warfare. And I hear the Lord said, breakthrough is imminent. And breakthrough must come. He said, prophet, I know you are trying to get through and you're trying again to sub, you know, limit me. And you're trying to break through for them. He said, but I'm not going to let you break through for those that will not break through for themselves nor break through for me. He said, they know God, oh, God help us. You see, y'all say this is an individual thing. The Lord said, uh-uh. He said, not so. This is no more individual because you didn't do nothing individually. Oh, no. Oh, no, you're talking about going back to normal? No, you and I will never go back to normal. No, no, we will not go back to normal. Not ever again. The Lord said this is not an individual thing. This is a corporate thing. This is universal. This is all of your health care packages. Yes, we are praying for the frontliners. We are tired of talking about them. The nurses, the doctors, we're seeing it all. But yet pride of man will not allow them to bow in the land. And the Lord said, I've sent dew and I've sent rain. In the midst of tornadoes, tearing through Mississippi and Alabama. Hadn't heard from no families. Hadn't heard from nobodies. And I'm not worried about none of them. Why? Because I trust God. As long as I keep his word, he'll take care of my family in my business or what I had left. He'll take care of all of that. So in the midst of whatever is happening, you've got to understand that God is not answering arrogance. You got pastors that are dying. Because of arrogance. I know that God is more powerful than COVID-19 and more powerful than this disease. What are you talking about? He allowed the disease. Now you dead. Now your wife's sick. Pastors are dying. Black people, 70%. I'm tired of that for black people only. I don't want to talk about that. Don't want to talk about privileges. Don't want to talk about no polices. You look at the road now. Look at the highway now. Where are the murderers? Where are the robbers? Where are the drug dealers? Uh, they're not doing no more than what they was doing before. Now you see true protect and serve. You don't, you don't see, seek, and destroy no more because they running for their own life. Jesus want to know one thing. Who is king? Who is the creator of the heaven and the earth? Who is Lord of Lord and king of kings? Is Jesus king or is it COVID-19? Ready your message. Colossians chapter number one, verse number three. We give thanks to God and the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, praying always for you since we heard of your faith in Christ Jesus and the love which you have. 
to all the saints. I'm so tired of your Christians getting on your broadcasts, talking about your God, your Jesus. Yes, I'm being, I, I want to be as sarcastic as I can. Your faith healers telling you about this is just the flu. And if you got symptoms, start praising and shouting and giving God thanks because God's going to heal you. Mr. Preacher, Mr. Faith Healer, if that's the case, why don't you get all your family together and have a big old party? If that's the case, why don't you go to the hospital and start emptying out COVID-19? You got people that are prospering, scamming governments, income tax. It's a shame. Making money, selling souls to the deaf angel. Hey, deaf angel, I got a soul over here. I'm going to raise the mask. You can't find no alcohol except at that liquor store. Y'all got that? You can't find no hand sanitizer, chloride, any cleaning supplies. What happened to cleanliness is next to godliness. I bet you it's next to godliness now. No, it's further away from God. People observing the stars. Celebrities coming on TV, promoting their little stuff. Everybody doing everything. Doing the cha-cha dance. Doing... Sitting up singing Amazing Grace. The Pope separated. The whole house destroyed. But people still not turning to God. They still won't deal with 2 Chronicles 7 and 14. We got all this going on. Devastation across the land. And what folks doing? Making money. Scammers. Schemers. Liars, hustlers, scamming the government, stealing the money from the top to the bottom. Stealing money from souls that's locked up in refrigerators, from nurses out there crying because they're afraid for their lives. From protective equipment being sold and bargained. While we opening the graves and we expect God to heal us, we expect God to bless us, we want God to stop. No, no, sir, Mr. Preacher, Mr. Mega Ministry, you trying to figure out now how you're going to transfer this thing in the future. We've been doing this. Could you imagine doing this every day? For, except Saturday, for 365 days a year, for I don't know how many years now, volunteering. That's right, volunteering to do this. Could you do this volunteer for seven years? Five, I don't know how long, I lost count. And say the same thing over and over again. And people still not, could you do it, sir? No, but now you're doing it. You where I am. You finally caught up with me. Facebook says, y'all can be happy now. Y'all are justified. I do apologize for you going on your little landline ministry trying to draw in some folks to give you money. I'm sorry, you can do it now. Everybody doing it now. So y'all welcome to it. Selling souls. People dying. And the deaf angel out there selling souls. Buying souls. Bargaining. They don't care. God said, no. Y'all don't want this removed. You don't want nothing lifted up. No. He won't even let me. He won't even let me do nothing. I'm tired of fighting. I really am. But I can't stop. You see. Uh, see. You, you got to know what, how people think. You got to know how people think. Know how people think. You know, and, and a lot of folk, Prophet Johnson, why won't you? 
Yeah, let me tell you something. I know those preachers what, what may meant well, but I'm not so arrogant and so dumb and so stupid to go out there and challenge God without God giving me permission. The Lord wake up and say, go. Then he going to give me the connections, and we walking in. Prophet Johnson, no mask. No, no nothing. All, all, I got every mask the government can I got every mask. M95. I got, I, got, I got all of them. Every mask. I got them all. And I know that there'll be many people saying, I hope, he get, I hope they kill him. Don't worry. I'll make out the wheel. I'll make out the wheel. There's not much left. I told Cap, I'm going to let him have my white truck. I already told Cap that. So if he quit, and quit on him, not me. Here it is. That's a raggedy mug, but it's blessed of the Lord. Captain, I don't know where we are. You know what I think I'm going to do, Captain? I'm going to jump all the way down and get to the good part. Okay, is Jesus king or is it COVID-19? All right. Now, I got to go ahead and read because I'm bumping around too much. Christ Jesus in the love of hope, verse number five. For the hope which is laid up for you in heaven, whereof you heard before the word of the truth of the gospel which is to come unto you as it is in all the world. You heard of this same word in Africa, in India, in Indonesia. And, and Captain, I don't want to get into that message that you showed me, man. But I tell you what. India, y'all laid it on the leadership of the United States of America, boy. Don't mess with India over there, especially with that uh, hydrochloroxaphine drug. Lead them folks along. All right? Here it is. India don't play. As it doth also in you, since the day you heard of it and knew the grace of God in truth. You heard the gospel, the knew the grace of God in truth, but guess what? Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? God forbid. So we don't go out challenging God. We don't go out doing this or that. As you also learn of Ephesus, our dear fellow servant, who is for you a faithful minister of Christ, who also declared unto us your love in the spirit. We know about that for this cause. We also, since the day we heard of it, do not cease to pray for you. That's what we do here at Living Strong. That's why if there was ever time to sow a seed, now is that time. And to desire that you might be filled with the knowledge of his will, what God is doing during this time and all wisdom and spiritual understanding. This is a spiritual battle, not just a natural battle that you might walk worthy of the Lord uh, unto all pleasing, uh, being fruitful. Look at this right here in every good work uh, and increasing in the knowledge of God. Uh, Y'all excuse me, uh, strengthening with all might uh, according to his glorious power. Hold on a second unto all patience and that's what I don't have but that's what I do have because y'all in my world in long suffering with joyfulness that's what God is saying this is what's going to get us through giving thanks unto the Father which have made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light when we come out of this darkness we walking through light let me show you this who have delivered us from the power of darkness and have translated us into the kingdom of his dear son in whom we have redemption through the blood, even the forgiveness of sin. And that's what he won't. That's all God won't. I got to keep on reading, Captain, because my time, I know that clock and you can't fool me. Who is in the image, watch this, of the invisible God, the firstborn of every creature, invisible. What are we fighting? An invisible force. You can't tweet it away. You can't talk it away. Now watch this. But you can pray it away. Uh oh! No, 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 uh, uh, no, no. See, see, now, see, there we go. There we go. Like I said, this can be individual. This must be corporately. This must be universal. If my people, if we as take the lead in America, I wish to God that some leader, that anybody would get up. Y'all blasted out on your Facebooks 
and your tweets and sisters and your internets and, and your whatever them other things are. Y'all get them out there. Y'all do it. Help me. Help us. They're not, they won't do it, folks. Why are the preachers that have this whole Bible, why won't they acknowledge what we've been preaching for years? The preachers would get up. I know it by heart. We got tired of it. The Lord said, they'll come to church. If my people, you got to humble yourself, child, uh, and you got to come as an humble child before the Lord. Uh, if you don't come humble, uh, the Lord ain't going to hear your prayer. Uh, he'll cast you out. Uh, and when you humble yourself and pray, uh, God going to hear your prayer. He said, he'll come in. Uh, he'll heal your land. Uh, forgive your disease. Uh, cast out the devil. Uh, and you got to know how to come. Uh, and they taught us how to be humble before the Lord. Uh, that's how we got them in the church. Uh, we taught them to be humble. But it's amazing. Uh, it's a joke. Uh, and God is laughing. Uh, once again, uh, said prophet, uh, I'm going to let him come on you. Uh, I'm going to let him come on you. Uh, the spirit of laughter, uh, the spirit of joy, uh, the spirit of truth, uh, for they will not heed uh, to my word. Uh, visible and invisible, uh, I made them all. So I'm laughing once again at the drive through prayer. The preacher up on top of the roof. Oh, my heart. They got the guitar. They got the drum. They got the band playing. And folks in their cars waving their hand with their face mask on. You still praising. You are still worshiping. But you're not turning. We're not bowing. We're not coming together. It's about our own glory. I love it, Lord. You're laughing everywhere. Laughing in the city. Laughing in the street. Laughing in the church. Zechariah came down and the angel stood there and God said, what are you doing? They said, the whole earth is standing still. Ain't no man working. Ain't no man worshiping. Ain't no man praying. He stood against uh, the mulberry tree uh, which represented the blood. Uh, and when I see the blood, uh, I'll pass over you. Uh, and once again, uh, if my people, uh, which are called by my name, uh, shall humble themselves uh, in prayer uh, and seek my face, uh, said the Lord, uh, come out of Sodom, uh, come out of America, come out of Gomorrah, come out of that great pontiff, uh, come out of uh, my people, uh, that great Vatican, uh, turn around, uh, turn around, it's time to come on home, it's Jesus King, a uh, COVID-19 shake, who is King, where is he? Who is king of kings? Lord of lords. Who else? The great I am. He's not king of our lives. Mighty is. COVID-19 has the days of our lives. This is another world as we watch the world burn. I mean turn. God is trying to get all of my children, I mean his children. Why? Soap opera. This is only Boeing Hope with one life to live. Come on, Jack. Come on, Jill. Come on, Victor. Let's give them a show. We love it. Give me my world back. I want my boat. I want my cars. I want my party life. I want my boogie woogie. I want my rendezvous. I want it all. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me, baby. Give it to me, Mary. Pet on. Mm -mm -mm. Make hard love had enough. Ain't had enough. No, we ain't had enough. 
greedy. I'm going to read this cap. Cap my read it and I finish. For by him were all things created that are in heaven and that are in the earth, visible and invisible. That means that God created, God allowably created COVID-19. You better believe it. You better believe it. See, here's the thing about it. Let me show you something. I'm not supposed to share this with you because Captain is not going to listen and y'all not either. I have a rather. Jesus is walking with the deaf angel. Oh, God. No, he did. Yes. G. Yes, he is. Jesus walking with the deaf angel. You up there? I, I, the Lord got me. The Lord gonna protect me. Uh, don't worry about COVID nineteen. Uh, the deaf angel said, "Lord." The Lord said, "Well, take him. Boop, you dead. Come on with me." Jesus, what are you doing here? That, that, that. Jesus said, I know it. But you're going to play with me. You're going to test me. They don't want me to come between. They don't want me as a great orchestrator. They don't want me as a great mediator. They want their soul system back. That's all they want is the system back. Look at your celebrities. Look at your media. Look at your... My blood. <sighs> uh, uh, Captain, Captain, I got two. Uh, I got, hold on. I, I got a, a minute left, too. Now let me read this and finish. He said, whether there be thrones, presidents or leaders or kings or queens, dominions or principality, that's COVID-19, or powers, or all things. He said, whatever it is, all things were created by him and for him. COVID-19 or is Jesus king. COVID-19 was created allowably by God by satanic order just like Job. Have you considered the earth? Have you considered COVID-19? Have you con The devil said, I guarantee you, if you let me get COVID-19 to earth, if you let me get it down there, they not going to turn from you to you. They not going to praise you. They not going to change. And God threw it in and said, oh my God, this is the trump card. I'm going to play the trump card, but I've got an ace in the space. Uh, I've got an ace in the hole. Uh, I've got a prophet in the land uh, that you got to fight like hell uh, to beat down heaven. Uh, you got to get through prophet Johnson. Uh, you got to get through this word. Uh, he'll die facing you. Uh, he got nothing to lose. Uh, lost everything. Uh, have you considered the Joe prophet? Scotty Lee Johnson of Mississippi broken inside you've got to get through him you've got to come through 2 Chronicles 7 and 14 Cap hold on didn't I say I'm finished why are you rushing me he said all things by him created for him and he is before all things COVID-19 and by all things by him all things consist COVID-19, and he is the head of the body, the church, church of Christ, church of ice. Lord, help us all. We're faking a $3 bill. Oh, $3 bill, fake church, fake line leaders, hypocrites, don't say nothing on TV, all for your money, your programmer. Yeah, I said it, and I'm mad, and I'm closing and out of breath. Who is the beginning the firstborn from the dead. Did you hear that? The firstborn from the dead. That in all things he might have the preeminence, COVID-19. For it pleased the Father that in him should all fullness dwell. 
and having made peace through the blood of his cross, when I see the blood, I pass over you. Come on, I'm going to anoint myself one more time. Whew. And by him, Alpha Omega, the sign of the cross. By him to reconcile all things unto himself. That's you and I. And by him, I say whether they be things in earth or things in heaven. And you that were sometime alienated. That's you and I. And enemies in your mind. That's you and I. By wicked works. I can't say that now. Yet now hath he reconciled in the body of his flesh through death to present you wholly unblameable and unreprovable in the sight, in his sight. Cam, if you let me burn up in here again on purpose like that, man, I'm going to knock the devil in the head on you. Well, you better get some air in here next time. Don't ever burn me up like this. If you continue in the faith, grounded and settled, and be, God said I can't knock you in the head because I got to bless you. And be not moved from the hope of removing COVID-19, last verse, of the gospel which you have heard and which was preached to every creature which is under heaven whereof I, Prophet Scotty Lee Johnson, the Apostle Paul, am made a minister. That's all there is to it. You can sit up, you can fight me tonight. They can, they can, I, 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 I tell them to burn up the message. Y'all always want something new. Oh, where, where are we going to get something? You ain't even ate what was old yet. Y'all got leftover living strong. Some of y'all fat off living strong, but you don't give nothing. You need to sow a seed and be through with it. And that's all there is to it. Captain, I don't know who all I'm supposed to give a shout out to, but I didn't give a shout out to everybody I'm going to give a shout out to. You know, I, I thank God for Donovan. Donovan, thank God for you, brother. And I shout out to you. All right? And, and the rest of y'all. Whoever y'all are. And, oh, shout out to Sister Brunel. Brunel, shout out to you. Thank God for your faithfulness and asking about me. I got the message. I know that y'all thought the tornado blowed me away in that little bitty little, little hut that I was in and everything else. But I want y'all to know, God, God gave me a little bit of brick and a little bit of wood, and he took me out of the straw. So I thank him because at least I got a, at least a little cabin to hide in now. And if a storm come up, you know, me and the dogs, we all right. But anyway, y'all, thanks for asking, asking about me. Cap, my time is up. Will y'all repeat after me? Say, Father, I'm a sinner. Forgive me for my sins. And I receive Jesus Christ as my Lord and my Savior. And I thank you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Is Jesus king or is it COVID-19? I'm going to get out this inferno and I'll see y'all tomorrow. Y'all have a good night, oh, and I say to you, bow, bow.